This morning, we are catching up with a talented actor whose latest project is a labor of love. Nicola Peltz Beckham wrote, stars in, and directs the new film Lola. She plays the title character, a young woman trying to make a better life for herself and her younger brother. All the while battling a strained relationship with her mother. The closest pharmacy to the house has still got a shop here. Ooh. <laughs> The rumors are true, but let me guess, you don't know who the father is. Mm. You're the worst excuse at the moment. Well, I don't know about that. You never met mine. Wow. Oh. Nicola, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We're going to be careful to not give away too much of, of the plot because it is uh, there's some twists and some turns in it as well. We've seen you act before, but at this time, you, you star in it, you wrote it, you're directing it, six years in the making. Is this something you always wanted to do? Well, thank you guys so much for having me here this morning. Um, I always loved writing, but it was more of a private thing for me. It was always something that I did to prepare for my acting roles. And then one day I just wanted to, to try to write a script and that ended up happening. But I never honestly planned on directing Lola. I always wanted to direct in the future. Um, but my producer, Will McCants, um, he really was the one that gave me enough confidence to Go for it. To yeah. do it. But I, I, all I knew was, like, I, I really want a female to direct this. That mm. was something that was really important to me. And you happen to be one. So <laughs> worked out, I was worked like, out we're pretty go. well. That checks the box. So, yeah, like, so we're there halfway you go. there. And it's your play, pay, this way you don't, don't have to pay yourself. Uh, no, yeah, but, exactly. But, but seriously, that, that kind of, I always wonder, what is it like for an actor mm. to be directed by themselves? How do you know how you're doing? Mm. I acted in the scene and we only had time to do a few takes because it was an independent film and you're always losing time on everything. Mm -hmm. um, but when I felt like the other actor and I got to a place that felt really good in the moment, then I would take a second and look at the monitor and just make sure everything worked out and felt really great. But the one thing I was really, uh, it was really important to me was when I was directing Luke, who plays Arlo. He's the little, plays my little brother in the film. Mm -hmm. I never wanted him to feel like he was directing or acting with his director. I always wanted him to feel really oh. safe. Mm -hmm. So before we got to set, we hung out a lot and, and painted each other's nails and did bracelets and really bonded because I wanted him to feel like, look at me really like an older sister, not that he was that. in a scene with his director. Yeah. So that was really important. I love that. The theme of friendship runs deep in this film, and I heard that Lola's best friend was actually inspired by one of your really yes. good friends. My that's best friend. Your that best is, friend. Yes, that's true. Even Babina's based off Ange, and she and I have been best friends since we were 14. Oh, wow. Mm. Yeah. Seems like you've got quite the uh, support system. We saw the, uh, the at the premiere, you know, another one of your good friends there, Selena Gomez was there. Yeah. Of course, your mother-in-law, Victoria Beckham, she happened to be there. And oh, by the way, the hubby, uh, Brooklyn there, of course. Ha yeah. Had he seen the movie before the premiere? A million times. <laughs> Like, truly. Like, when my mom was playing the trailer one day in the other room, and he mouthed every word. I was like, that's really? terrifying. Yeah. That's because cool. sometimes it's the other way around. For stuff. Yeah. You know, they haven't seen anything. That's pretty cool. That my dad, right. it was the first time my dad saw it. But yeah. What do you think? Well, it was hard for him, I think, to watch uh, it, but he said he was really proud, and that means the world to me. Of course it does. My gosh. And, and you're about to celebrate your second anniversary. Uh, you know, you're in this this family that's out there a lot. How, how, how does that... Uh, how, what is that dynamic like? I come from a big family that we are all so, so close. And now having an even bigger family and, and Brooklyn grew up so close with his family. So now for us to all be able to spend so much time together, I feel so lucky. They're the most amazing people in the world. And the fact that Victoria flew out to support me meant so much to me. It really oh, did. Uh, I love those. Congratulations. Come back yeah. anytime. Thank you, you so much. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I appreciate that. Lola, by the way, is going to be available in select theaters and on demand starting February 9th. All so right. nice having uh -huh. you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you guys for having Lola, me. You bet. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or Click the link right here.